All eyes on Marcus Rashford. Will he shine against his former club? We're live next, so don't go anywhere. Well, everyone is happy here at Old Trafford for the time being. I say that because the sun is shining brightly. I'm Derek Ray, and sharing commentary with me, as usual, is Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It is Manchester United up against Watford. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. This is the team Manchester United will go with. Well, I think they have a nice balance to their team. A solid back four, two holding midfielders, three creative players in advance of them, and a mobile centre forward. It's a good team. And the starting 11 for Watford. Well, it's great to see them playing with the front two. But for it to work, they need to have a good understanding. They need to link up with each other and provide a different set of skills. Thank you for attending Old Trafford. Enjoy the match. And so the battle commences. Mikau Tadze, Melamed. Well, full marks for getting past him. Locatelli. Patient enough build up. Can they carve out a chance? Oh, that's a fine save. And he's fired over the corner. And that was goalkeeping right out of the top drawer. It's absolutely remarkable. His reflexes were brilliant there. Very quick thinking there. Rashford. So let's have a look at the table and the chances there for the visitors to go top if they can win. Well, the fixtures are coming thick and fast at the moment, but I have to say they've looked a top-class team so far. They're certainly playing some very good football. George Mikau Tadze. How can he take them on and beat them? Sancho. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Well, the fans are going mad here. They think that was a penalty. Pedro. Trying to open them up. Nice looking move. pushing for it and now they've been rewarded well as you can see the weight of the through ball is key to this goal and what a clinical finish this is from Foden he hits it with such power that's an excellent goal so on they go again and that really should shake up United can they find a response now Super tackle and they've won possession. It's with Andrade. It's been pretty well impossible to escape all the news stories surrounding him ahead of today's match. Playing against his old club and I wonder what's going through his mind, Stuart. Well, he shouldn't approach this differently to any other game. He's just got to forget the crowd and go out and play. Well, the keeper has outdone himself. Wonderful save.
Melamed. Sancho. And playing it through. He's just got to continue his run. Oh, did so well to deny him. Well, can they draw level here? The crowd certainly thinks so. And played short. And routine for the keeper in the end. The cross far too close to him. Clark. Pedro. Takes it on. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, a bit short with the clearance. Counter-attacking chance. Need to get back quickly here. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Well, getting very close to the half-time interval, and it's a narrow lead for the visitors to this point. Stuart, how would you assess what we've seen? Well, I think they've been the better side in this first half. They've defended well, they've looked dangerous in attack, and they've controlled the midfield. It's been a solid performance so far. Marcus Rashford. Well, the stoppage time situation, one minute here. And so the first half story has been written. Half time here at Old Trafford. Not to be too blunt about it, Stuart. And the. Second half here at Old Trafford has commenced. They've given it away. Locatelli. Now just the tackle that was needed. Joao Pedro. Well, this is one you won't want to miss here on EA TV Live. The second and decisive leg of the Champions League round of 16 tie. It's Watford taking on Bayer Leverkusen. Well, the first leg was a tough game, so I'm expecting a really tense second leg. What a reward for the winners. A place in the quarterfinals. Gardner. Andrade with it. Happy just to retain the ball in their own half and draw out the opposition. And Schultz now. Rashford and the cross into the middle well I suspected that might be difficult for the keeper but I was wrong a reminder the food stands will be open after the game if you'd like to get yourself some points match. can he find the right pass Rashford and there's a quality defender in action Schultz and an astute piece of defending and space to cross it Foden it's there for him excellent block Denied once more. And stopping the danger.
Difficult to stop him. And crossed in the direction of the back post. And they can't quite take advantage in the end. George Mikautadze. Now breaking at pace. Potential danger. The fans want to see a shot. And saved by the keeper. Here it is now. A substitution. And short it is. Sancho. The cut back. Grabs off the keeper. Oh, what an astonishing save. Well, that save has probably won the game for his team. Brilliant stuff from the keeper. And it's still on. Danger averted. Pressure applied. Can they make something of it? Ugarte. Well, strong play here. Pulls it back. Well, a corner it is, and they know they've got to be opportunistic at this stage of the game. Oh, disappointing clearance. He can't hold on to it. Well, it comes to nothing in the end. And there it is, the final whistle, and it's the Watford fans who'll be going home happy following this victory. Well, Derek, they didn't dominate the game by any means today, but overall they had the better of the chances and just about deserved their win. Well, a lot of positives as we reflect on what we saw from Phil Foden in this match. Well, he obviously scored the winning goal, but it was his overall performance that impressed me most. He was on fire today. And this confrontation is underway. 